Four seconds on a stop clock. Four seconds on a stop clock. Holy mackerel, can you believe this? Bill McKenzie is on. He is two for five in field goal. From the 28, it will be a 38-yard attempt. The snap, McKenzie kicks it. It is long enough. McKenzie kicks it. It is good. The ball game is over. McKenzie kicks a 38-yard field goal in the final play of the football game. There's a mob scene out on the field. The Mountaineers, the Mountaineer fans, what a mob scene. You haven't seen anything like it. Bill McKenzie kicks a 38-yard field goal on the final play of the football game. West Virginia moving the ball down to the pit 22-and-a-half-yard line on a pass to Randy Swinson. And then... The field goal drive by McKenzie. I can't believe it. McKenzie, the sophomore from Warwood, with the biggest kick of his young career. West Virginia lined up to go. There's a fake. Hostetler keeps the ball, rolls around the right side into the end zone to score. Hostetler with a great fake. He carries it around the right side. He takes it into pay dirt with a great block from Rob Bennett. Jeff Hostetler behind the block by Bennett goes in to score. And the West Virginia Mountaineers with 6.27 on the clock go into the lead. 23-21. Zeroway breaks over the left side. Look at him go. Look out. They're not going to catch him. They don't catch him. Amos Zeroway going for the touchdown. On fourth down and four. And Marshall takes the snap. He drops back as time fires the ball deep downfield for Pennington. There's contact, passes, ball in, and is caught. Touchdown! John Pennington hauled in a touchdown from 28 yards away. What a catch for John Pennington. The second game changing play came on Pitt's opening possession of the second half. The Panthers had driven inside the WVU 10. But Grant Wiley's interception of Pitt quarterback Rod Rutherford in the end zone ended that scoring opportunity. And the Mountaineers had the Panthers rattled the rest of the night. West Virginia, 52. 16th ranked Pitt, 31. Defense has almost given up about 250 yards and with HB blades out. What kind of adjustments do you look well, to make in a second? The two biggest plays they made are double screens, and we've covered the double screen both times, and the quarterback tucked the ball and ran. 
you don't practice those plays. Kids making great plays. We, we just got to run faster. It's real simple. What does your offense need to do? Because you're only oh, down eight oh, here. We got guys open. I mean, we got guys open and running the ball. We're going to score some points. We got to just make some plays. We had two drops there at the end. You know, it could have been uh, completions. And uh, like I say, defensively, the, the quarterback's making some great plays on his own, athletically. They're not designed plays. And, uh, you know, we just got to run faster. It's simple as that. You know, we just got to run faster. It's simple as that. You know, we just got to run faster. It's simple as that. You know, we just got to run faster. It's simple as that. You know, we just got to run faster. It's simple as that. You know, we just got to run faster. It's simple as that. You know, we just got to run faster. If you're, if you're a younger player from Pitt's last game of the year, the fans would stand here in every form and five against number five, Virginia Tech, 745 Eastern. Run, Coach Davey and Holly will have that for you. Third down, the pressure comes, a pick six. Jamil Adai. Perhaps going to de-emphasize the running aspect of his game and keep throwing it. Said so there's nothing wrong with the left arm. White toe looks okay. Gets around the corner, has a crease. Pat White gone. Pat White on the West Virginia touchdown. In the end zone. Shocker. White thrown as a man wide open. It's Slayton. He doesn't lose foot races. Forty-six to go in the third quarter, tied at six. Divine on the loose. Noah Divine. Incredibly Divine touchdown. All the people right now depending on you. A freshman out of Springfield, Virginia. All the people, and this is the State University of West Virginia now, Mark. How many people counting on Tyler Bittencourt? And Pitt had good pressure on that last field goal attempt, Mark. I mean, put yourself in this guy's shoes. From 43 yards out for the win for the Mountaineers. Bittencourt. He's excited. He got it. They win it. That's what it's 
all about, Mud. Look right there. They're not saying Bill Stewart was too, too conservative now by playing for the field goal, are they? Tears of joy epitomizing the intense feelings in this rivalry. Thank you very much, Quint. On third down for West Virginia, Geno Smith going deep. Has Tavon Austin behind the defense, and he's got it. Austin inside the 10. Touchdown, West Virginia, 71 yards. Shit! 